So Norman, Oklahoma is a growing city just south of Oklahoma City. And today I wanna to take you on a tour of one of the neighborhoods in South Norman that I think you'll really like. I'm Marcy Billen and I'm a real estate agent in Norman, Oklahoma. And today I wanna to take you on a tour of the neighborhood called Cedar Lane in Norman. So it's in South Norman, it's just south of Highway 9 and off of 12th Avenue Southeast. So this location in Norman means that people have really great access to the University of Oklahoma, um, NCED, the Postal Training Center, Hitachi, and a lot of other businesses, including the National Weather Center. There are, of course, other neighborhoods in this area as well, including uh, Bellatona, Eagle Cliff, Summit Valley, and then we also have really great access to the city of Noble, which is just south of Norman on Highway 77 as well. If you wanna see more of my Norman, Oklahoma neighborhood tours, go ahead and check out the link. It'll be here, but also in the description. So Cedar Lane was established in around 2011 when the first houses were being built down here in this particular neighborhood. So the homes range between like a, tr a traditional style, there's a lot of modern homes, and of course we have some beautiful farmhouses too. And this neighborhood is not specific to one builder like several other neighborhoods are. So we have lots of different builders that are building in here including but not limited to um, Tabor Homes. We have Harbor Homes, uh, Megatel, DNC Investments, Sooner Traditions. So you'll find a variety of different homes in here which will help the neighborhood feel like it's a little bit more varied. There's also of course a lot of house plans that are available. These homes have a mix between two and three car garages. Some will only have two, some will definitely have three. This is also a pretty new neighborhood being built in um, or started in 2011. It does have an HOA, a rec center, and a community pool that's brand new. There's also a pond that's stocked for the residents of the neighborhood as well. So homes in this neighborhood range between like 1,600 square feet all the way up to like around 2,800 square feet with most sitting between like 2,000 and 2,300-ish square feet. And almost all of them are at least three bed, two bath. I don't know of any one of them that doesn't have three bedrooms. Some of them may even have four, and I've seen a few in this neighborhood that actually have five bedrooms. So living here means that you would have easy access to a lot of great amenities, um, including this, you know, a huge Walmart that we have here on the way to Noble. There's Starbucks in all these. Um, Panda Express. And then of course, as you travel north into Norman, you'll get a ton more um, like salons and businesses, another Walmart that's a neighborhood market instead of a super center. And of course, all that is right on your way to campus if you're needing to work at OU. Some cons that I've heard people talk about living in this neighborhood is of course, you usually have to use Highway 9. Um, kind of no matter where you're going, Highway 9 is just a busy highway that goes in the south of Oklahoma and it cuts through Norman on the south side. People definitely can move pretty fast on this highway. They did redo it recently, so it is nice um, to have that like fresh new road and um, stoplights at every major intersection for safety. I also have a Norman, Oklahoma relocation guide that's listed in the description as well. Thanks so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. I would definitely watch this video next.